We arrive on time at the Kafour supermarket at the Hub shopping mall to capture the opening of bells of Unga that have just been delivered. At 90 shillings apiece, shoppers move with haste to buy the flour that is now in short supply. Sumbaka, you have to travel like a long distance. Like for me, I live in Nairobi West. I've come to Karen Hub to buy Unga. Within a short while, the 400 bells will have sold out. Demand here, as in other parts of the country, far outweighs supply. Two are enough for now. In fact, I was thinking I'd bring a friend Good stuff. and take another extra two, but unfortunately I'm, I'm alone, so I'll take these two. Kilometers away in Waithaka area of Dagoretti South constituency, the situation is worse. Wama Shell's shop best proves that Unga is now just a dream for many. <laughs> It's almost a week now since she's stocked out and there are no signs of new deliveries. A situation replicated in Garissa where supermarkets are stocking everything but unga. In mid-May, the government announced a 6 billion shilling May subsidy to lower the cost of unga to 90 shillings for a 2 kg packet. Supply has been on and off, but now even the unsubsidized unga is missing in shelves. It is a situation that will most likely get worse in coming days, with a number of millers already having closed shop for what they term as an acute shortage in May supply. The last three days have seen at least eight millers stop operations in Wasin Gishu County. The situation leading to losses and agitated customers. Agriculture CS Willy Bet has maintained that the subsidy program is merely facing some teething problems and that supply will soon stabilize. Patrick, a Gunza citizen, weakened.